Hi, uh, this is Stefan Wutarisha. And uh, yeah, welcome to this uh, video, which is going to be mm, a bit uh, challenging and uh, a first time for me because I'm going to try to share with you my, uh, my creative process uh, in real time, in somewhat in real time, because um, most of the, all of the video I've been recorded until this point, I, I was simply recording the, uh, the process, the full process, and then I was coming back uh, and uh, edit the audio on the time lapse, on a time lapse version to uh, try to, to comment what I was doing. But right now I would like to bring you with me inside the creative journey, especially for this uh, subject I would like to cover, which is uh, narrative illustration. And I'm calling this narrative illustration just to um, keep things a bit casual, but for me it's it's much more than just creative illustration. It's really an in a, in a introspective uh, trip inside my my own mind, my my own symbolism, and uh, my own story. And uh, through this illustration, I I try to connect personal. Uh, events. I try to connect uh, thoughts that are meaningful for, for me, uh, position about uh, things like, you know, society, ethic, and uh, yeah, it's it's what I, I enjoy to do the most, and uh, this is, I think, what really makes me love to, to do art as a living. So, I'm thinking of of this kind of images, for example, which which is far from being a great image, but it's one I really enjoyed to uh, to create actually because it 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 yeah it it was it was very fun to do and it's it really it really is for me an introspective way of of exploring my own inner. I would say mind, but also psychology and history and so on, and just to connect to connect things together. I, I've been a musician, a professional mu musician, for ten years in my life. So music has played uh, an important part of uh, in my creative process overall. And I think I've been connecting a lot of things I I, I learned in music, in visual art, because there is a lot of uh, of common points between, I think, these two forms of art uh, at the abstract level and the way you construct composition and uh, the way you can connect uh, these abstract structures either in, in time and space for music or with visual signals for, for visual arts. Uh, so hopefully this is going to make sense when, when, I'll, be, when I'll be exploring that. But even, even this one is really truly related to, to some personal to some personal background and, and, uh, and feelings. Yeah, sorry, my, my connection sucks. So uh, this is this is also an image I, I did in the same kind of state of mind with themes that are very recurrent in my work, which, which are water, um, sea, Fishing, <laughs> so though I never fished, when I think on, I never fished in my life, or the few time I tried, it was a total failure. But yeah, for for, for some reason, it's it's, uh, it's important for me. And uh, yeah, scale scale. I think this is something I, I really I really love to explore in my work. The uh, the oniric feeling of scale. The, uh, the improbable, improbable um, scale that exists when we are when we have dreams or, or nightmares, and uh, I think we all had this uh, this dream of, of us falling in a, in deep uh, in in deep spaces. Yeah, so this is something I wanted to explore in this image. And yeah, there is a lot of things, but I, I'm not going to talk about this image right now, but I'm going to talk about the, uh, the sober process behind making uh, another one. 
so. Yeah, the image layer like this one is also something that is deeply connected to to um, an a really inner exploration of a of, of a state of mind I, I was into and. Uh, yeah, it was, was also a lot of, uh, I don't know if it was a lot of fun, maybe it's not the word, but uh, it was very enjoyable. Though I, I feel quite terrible about this image. I mean, I'm really not happy with the uh, with the execution of the image. I think it's, it's really far from being uh, a piece I'm, I'm happy with. But uh, yeah. Uh, I, I really enjoyed the process of, uh, of creating uh, the image and connecting really, uh, making the free association process working and connecting different parts of symbolism that exist for myself and hopefully that exist also in some way in society because uh, I, I'm only the product of, uh, of, of what I learn through the society I'm living in. So. A lot of symbols that exist for me are likely to exist for for society too. <laughs>